Hey everyone, Joe here. Today I got a gear review for you. This is the Benro A18T aluminum monopod. Now, this monopod I bought uh, not too long ago, about a month and a half ago, to carry with me up to Hong Kong when I went on a photo trip and stuff. And I wanted it for use for uh, street photography. And I'd like to talk about this because I actually really do like this product. Okay. It is aluminum. It's a magnesium aluminum, aluminum monopod. It has four segments, which are all the twist lock. You know, you lock it in, and it holds it. Okay. These are rubber grips, so you can lock these in pretty good, and then lock them in. This one has this uh, swivel, movable pad type here. I'm not really fond of the pad too much, uh, although I can think of a lot worse things. It does seem to work uh, fairly okay. I wish it was a little more rubbery for uh, slicker, uh, slicker surfaces. But, however, like a uh, lot of these bin rows, it has, you can actually remove it if you don't like it and replace it with anything else you want. So you're not stuck with it. Okay, it's got a nice foam uh, pad grip up here with bin row written on it. And it has a 316, which is also, you can uh, loosen it and flip it around for quarter inch to mount your camera to it. Now this one I have flipped around to 316 to fit little, you know, small ball heads too, which comes in very handy. Although I am going to have to find another ball head because I don't particularly like that one too much. That one, that uh, ball head I have there is a Dolica Proline B100. You know, it's about as cheap as you can get. I want to find a nicer aluminum one that's a little bit lighter. Uh... Anyway, so you can put your camera on it or you can mount a ball head. And I do think they even make, uh, Benro makes uh, mounting plates for these. You know, they'll have a little bit lower profile than having a huge ball head. So I may be looking into that pretty soon also. It has a nice little strapper here to hold it. It's actually fairly light, weighs 1.65 pounds. It, uh, and it fully extends out to, uh, I think, 5.25 feet. So, you know, it gets on there pretty good. I'm four foot six, so uh, I think I'm four foot six. No, I, I actually have moved taller than that. I'm thinking five foot six, excuse me. <laughs> so, it, it gets about a head high with me, is what I was trying to get at. But, uh, so I said, it is lightweight, very travel friendly. I uh, enjoy using it. Uh, like I said, though, when I was out doing street photography, I realized, you know, taking this, screwing it on and off your camera and come up with a big hassle. And, you know, monopod's supposed to be, you know, to help, you know, relieve hassle of having a tripod. So I recommend do getting the adapter plate for it. Uh, what else can I think about this one? Uh, other than I really have enjoyed using it. And, uh, if you're interested in this, you know, check out my Amazon affiliate link down the bottom. Um, now set up to be affiliate with Amazon. So if you're interested in any of the products I talk about in my gear reviews or uh, previews and stuff, you know, check out the links. It doesn't cost you any extra, but you know, Amazon gives me a little bit of kickback. So it kind of helps me support the channel and bring in more products and stuff to review. So it's you know, it kind of helps both out. And uh, like I said, I really enjoy using this. These locks uh, hold very very nice. One more thing, the the shafts do not twist except for the bottom one. The bottom one will actually twist and turn, uh, but the other uh, segments, it is four total segments here. They do not uh, twist and turn within the, the assembly, so that's pretty good. Made in China, as if you expect it to be made anywhere else. The top part up here is a uh, not a super hard plastic, but it is plastic. It does come with a special tool to help you take the nut off, which you then uh, unscrew this. And flip it over, which it came with the quarter inch to start with. I had it, I flipped mine over for the 316th for the uh, uh, ball head and stuff. So, like I said, I really like this. Uh, if you like it, check out the affiliate link if you don't mind, please. And if you like this video, you know, how about give me a thumbs up? You know, thumbs up always highly appreciated. And if you like this video, you know, uh, well, give it a thumbs up again too. You know, two thumbs up if you can. But anyway, if you ain't not a subscriber, you know, please take the time to subscribe. Subscribe is free. It's for you. Let you know when I release more videos. And as always, everyone, thank you for watching.